Hey, 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 it's your girl Shakita Days, and I am known as the business technician simply because I help you fix your business. We are back with another Boss Up Visual podcast show. No more limitations, no more limitations in your life, no more limitations in your business, no more limitations in your relationship. And we went back on episode one and two, now entering episode three, just talking about you know, more than just life. We're talking about business. We're talking about relationships. We're talking about, you know, everything that's a part of your life and a part of growing and advancing. And a lot of times, you know, we have things that are going on in our lives. We want a better life. We want to live a certain way, but we're not taking the certain actions, action steps to get to that destination. A lot of people, they sit on the couch and they watch TV. They dream about the things that they want to do. They dream about the places that they want to go. And they're never reaching any goals in their life because they're sitting there. You just fantasize about all these things you want to do. And one thing you have to realize is that when you get sick, what do you do? You have to go to the doctor when you get sick. So these are the same traits that we have to use when we're living our life when we're pursuing our dreams because you notice if you have pain or if you're sick you take medicine but if you don't take that medicine then you don't get better so just like in life or in business or when you're trying to enhance your finances if you don't do anything to make that happen nothing's going to happen if you don't take that step to make it happen nothing's going to happen so you have to stop putting limitations on your life i don't care what it is Right now, your limitation may be money. Right time, your right now, your limitation may be time. But we have to stop putting limitations on the important things because these are the things that are going to help us navigate through life obstacles. And I know a lot of times when you want to get that new purse or you want that new pair of shoes or you want to go to that show or that concert, you make a way to get that money to do it. So we got to start using that same energy to make a way for you to invest in yourself, invest in your life and your dreams so that 2025 will not look like 2024. You do not want your 2025 to look like 2024, 2023, 2022, or 2021 because it's been depressing. It's depressing and it's not good for your health. So what are you going to do today that's going to change your tomorrow? We got to stop soaking and drowning in our misery. Saying, hey, you know, I want to live like this. Why is this person living this way? You have to create it. You got to create the life that you desire to live. And the only way to do that is to take action. Nobody's going to do it for you. You have to do it for yourself. You have to meet yourself halfway to get it done you have to take that first step and when you take that first step you got to take the second step when you take the second step you got to stay consistent you're not willing to stay consistent you're not willing to stay dedicated committed to your goals committed to the activity committed to the activity that needs to be done that is necessary for you to reach certain life life goals, to get through certain obstacles in life. A lot of us, we wish for it, but we don't want to work for it. You can't keep wishing for things to happen without work. Just like the Bible said. Just like the Bible said, faith without work is dead. Faith without work is dead. You can wish and hope all you want, If you don't do anything to get it, you're not going to get it. You're not going to get it. Got to stop wishing. Got to stop sitting on the couch. Daydreaming about everybody's life but yours. But you got to look at all the years and the months and the days that added up to the time that you got to the age that you are, the time that you got to the place that you are. And take a look at your life and the things that you did to get to the point that you're at today and why you're not in the place that you want to be. 
So you have to understand when you're looking at people's lives, you're looking at all these famous people, all of these celebrities and everything, all of these people, they work hard to get to where they are. They took the time out of their busy day to work on their goals. They probably gave up going to parties. They probably gave up um, sitting on the couch watching TV. They probably gave up sitting on the couch watching a video game just to get these things done. They gave up hours in their day for tomorrow, to change their lives for tomorrow so that they can relax in the future. So sometimes you have to sacrifice some things. You gotta sacrifice, sacrifice some time. You gotta sacrifice your mind because your mind is very strong. Your mind is very strong. Your mind is very powerful. What you put in your mind, what you think that you can do, you can. What you think that you cannot do, you won't. So you have to think positive. Your mind has to be very positive for you to be able to reach those milestones in your life. Your life's not gonna change if you're being, if you if you're doing the same thing that you've done last year, you're doing the same thing that you did yesterday, you have to change your perspective of what you think life is. Do you want to be the person that's watching everybody living out their dreams? Or do you want to be the person living out their dreams? So when are you going to stop putting limitations on your life? When are you going to say no more limitations on my life. I don't care what it is. I don't care if I don't have the money. I'm not going to limit myself anymore. I'm going to do what I have to do to get to that next level. I'm going to make some sacrifices. I'm going to invest in myself. You have to invest in yourself. Make smarter investment decisions. If you don't know how to do that, get you a mentor. Get you a coach. Get somebody that can guide you and lead you in the direction that you need to change your life. Otherwise, you're going to be sitting there. You're going to always be waiting for something. You're going to always be asking for something. We got to get out of that. You can do it too. You can be that person that's living out their dreams if you just change your mindset and stop putting limitations on your life. So thank you guys for joining me for this episode three. Uh, We are giving away a free gift. So for those of you, if you tuned into the last episode, I want you to either email us at bossupvisualpodcast at gmail.com and give us some feedback on one of the episodes for a chance to win a free gift card. Also, if you subscribe to our podcast, all you got to do is visit the link that's on our Instagram page or our Facebook page for a chance to win a gift card. Become a subscribing member for a chance to win a gift card. And we'll see you guys on the next Boss Up Visual Podcast show. Remember to always stay bossed up.